uh, hey, my name is Ethan, and uh, I'm going to be showing you how to get uh, free music onto your Android device. Uh, in this case, I'm using the HTC One uh, Mini. Uh, it's all right; it's not the best, but it works on uh, every Android device. Um, it works on Apple as well. So, I've got my iPod here, my iPod Five. Um, and I've used this to put some songs on there as well, so uh, here it goes. So the first thing you're going to want to do is uh, open Chrome, or whichever search engine you use, stupid ads, uh, open iTunes, there you see I've got all my music, um, all of the top ones here, um, you see um, I have used uh, this method of getting them, so scroll down, I think it ends there, so this one here is where it ends, so I've done all of this using this method. Um, so in Chrome, you're going to want to open a few tabs, the first one's going to be YouTube, the second one is going to be YouTube Converter, and click the top one. And the second one is just going to be an open tab. Just leave it like that. Uh, what you also want to do is uh, go into your documents. Um, and in the download section, I've got edits, music, other stuff, just things that um, come on the computer. Uh, in music, this is where all of my downloads come from. So I've made a folder for all of the different artists that I've got. Um, just to keep it nice and tidy, because I like, I like it being tidy. So I've having music all the way down here. Um, so I recommend doing this. There's no benefit from it. It doesn't make it any different, but I just think it makes it look all nice and tidies it up. Um, so just leave it on the downloads, because when you first download your song, your converted song file, or whatever you want to call it, it's going to turn up around here. And then you're just going to click and drag it and move it into there. Um, so what you're going to do on YouTube is searching for a song. I've got a playlist here. I um, just need to find a song that I haven't already got. Let's go for Bless the Fall, uh, Hollow Bodies. So, let's take a little bit. Don't judge my music. So, I like the sound of this. Haven't got it on my... Uh, haven't got it on my phone yet. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to go up to the URL at the top here, double click it to highlight the whole thing, Control C to copy it, and go to YouTube Converter, click in the box, Control V and paste it. And then we're going to click Convert Video, and we're going to press Download. So as you can see, it starts downloading in the bottom left-hand corner down here, and now it's done. So we're going to go back over to our files, and you'll see, like I told you before, that the blast of the downloaded file, the, con the converted file, is in the downloads section. So we're just going to click and drag it, move it into music, double click in music, go down to the bottom, and because it's a blast of song, I'm going to click and drag it into the blast of album. All right, so um, now we have that blast of song right here. We're going to go over to iTunes, go to the top left hand corner, where there's a little book, I don't really know what it is, it's just a little symbol. Go to add file to library, and we're going to find that song that we just downloaded, this one. Ah, that's why, I've clicked the wrong one, it's already put in. Okay, so there we go, a little mistake, but oh well. Um, so there's the song. So as you can see, compared to the Mayday Parade one, uh, it's got no album art, and it's just blessed full hollow bodies. It's not laid out like any of the other ones, um, and this is where it gets not really complicated, but uh, just a little bit harder. Um, so for this one, we're going to use that extra tab that we opened, and we're going to try and Google what album. 
this song came from. And if we go to that one, we can see that it came from Is it called Hollow Bodies? Yep. Yeah. Okay then, so the actual album itself is called Hollow Bodies. So that makes it a little bit easier for us. So if we go to images and get the thumb well not the thumbnail, but the album cover for this particular album. Try and get the best quality picture. Right click, save image as. There we go. So we're running a little bit slow. So for the file name we just put hollow bodies. Sorry. On. Like that. And then save. You can see it starts downloading straight away. So now we go back over here. Right click on that song. Go down to get info. And basically we're just going to fill in all of these. So that's all you really need to do there. You might want to put genre in there, I don't know. I add artwork. We're going to go down and find it. There we go. So there it is. You can press OK. And you can see that it's changed. It looks professional, like all of the other ones. And now if we go back over to our folder that we made for the music, and nothing has changed except this mp3 audio file has got all of that information that we've just put onto the Apple, onto uh, iTunes. So it's got the artist picture, the album name, band name, everything. So simply, uh, I forgot to... Uh, plug my phone in. So now what I want to do is click and drag this file over to where your phone is or whatever audio device you're plugging it into. So now it's done. We go back and let me just prove to you that it is on the phone. If I... There we go. It's there. So as you can see, it's playing like any other song. It looks looks good. Turn it down a little bit. So that is how to get free music on any Android device. It works on anything, um, and it also works on Apple. Um, exactly the same, except with Apple. All you need to do with Apple is click and drag it straight off iTunes. So like you normally would, you click and drag it in your phone or iPod or whatever uh, Apple device would be up here and then just click and drop it. Um, and that's, that's pretty much it. Alright, thank you for watching. Um, something else that I just want to point out. Um, if you're using the actual um, official music video for the song, um, you might get little interruptions in the middle of it because of that's what the uh, the official video has um, so you're better off using say a lyrics video because it will the music will start right at the beginning of the song well the video um, and there won't be any interruptions in the middle like actor uh, like actors um, or anything like that uh, it just makes just makes it a little bit better um, for the audio quality and it makes it sound a little bit more professional and you aren't waiting like half a half a minute to, to just for your music to kick in. Um, but that's it. Alright, thank you very much.